yourself, you will honor your name and lift your name higher. Thank you, Lord, because we know you have answered. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. At this time, we want to begin to give thanks to God. We want to begin to worship him and praise his holy name. We want to begin to adore him and reverence his holy name. We want to lift his name higher because of whom he is. The Bible says, giving thanks unto the Father, who had made us to be partakers of the inheritance in light, who had delivered us from the powers of darkness, and have translated us into the kingdom of his dear Son. God has been so faithful to us, faithful to our family, faithful on every side. Let's express our profound gratitude unto this God, this great God, this great King, and the I am that I am. Let's worship him. Let's praise him. Let's honor him. Let's give him all the glory he deserves. And let's adore him. There is no one to be compared with him. He is God. He is king. He is the king of the day. He is the lion of the tribe of Judah. He is the bright and the morning star. He is the root of Jesse. Can you compare this God with any God? No. Can we compare him with any king? No. Can we compare him with anyone? No. Can we compare him with any personality? No. Can we compare him with any magician or astrologers or astronomers? No. God has no comparison. He is in, no, he's in, he's in his own class. Praise him. From the depth of your heart, Father, we thank you. Holy Spirit of God, we worship you. Spirit of the living God, we exalt your name. You are good. And your mercies endure it forever. Ancient of the day, we bow before thy throne of majesty. And we say, take the glory. And we say, take the honor. And we say, take the adoration. In the name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' name, we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' Amen. name we pray. Amen. So, Amen. Once, honor the Lord, once again, the year is running to an end. November will still roll over. And then we'll be coming to the last month of the year. And so we are entering the last month of the year. Obviously, next week we'll be entering the next. Uh, this is the last month of the year, and even though the year has been very, very tough for many, but God has been more for in keeping and protecting us. I just came in. I came in last night uh, after traveling for my mother-in-law burial on Friday, and I can tell you a lot of a lot of issues that how God in heaven, you know, in His infinite mercy, uh, showed us mercy. And then we came in in the night yesterday. You know, when I look at all of the things revealed before going for the barrier, and the thing that happened and all of that, I cannot but thank God for His mercy. I cannot thank I cannot but thank God for revealing things and all that. And so we are grateful to God to have known that God who knows the end from the beginning, who sees the end of the beginning, who revealed things even before they happen, and then we are. We are, we are able to use prayer to circumvent negative situation in life. Let's be grateful unto God for knowing him. Let's be grateful to God for having him to be our God. Let's be grateful to God for having him to be our Father. Let's be grateful to God for healing things to all. Lord, we want to help the children. We bless and refresh him for all that you have been doing, Lord. Father, you have been so good. And we walk into destruction. Oh, Jesus, you are fighting wonderful. Parties, you don't even know about them. You are fighting battles. You don't even know. Covering you. things that have happened to us. But oh, here we are. Lord, we worship you. Father God, now we bless you. My Lord, we reference you. We give you glory because you are God. Look at me, always here and there. Oh, Father, Father, you have been so good, O oh Lord. Father, you have been so nice. Who is like unto thee, O oh Lord? Father, if not you, if not you, would have been forgotten. O oh Lord, we just worship you. Father, we just bless you. My Lord, we just reference you. We give you glory. We give you honor. We give you adoration. Oh, thank you for our beloved pastor. 
Oh, well, for the mother's still lost barrier. Oh, Lord God, I will thank you for the testimonies we are hearing that you were there for them. Oh, Lord, if not you. Father, if not you. I also remember my friend that went for his uh, grandfather's barrier. I was telling me the funny, funny things that happened. How they Jesus were going to give them. Oh, Lord, we worship you, Lord. Amen. Now, um, here is the short uh, brief thing I will share with us quickly, and then we'll also say thank God. Prior to, prior to uh, my going for the uh, barrier, uh, that was the last thing. My wife traveled to the village. Before she traveled, God revealed something, and I shared with her, and then we prayed about it. She went, and she came back safely. And then we were to travel on Friday. By Thursday again, the Lord revealed. This time around, it was serious. And it was serious because it was particularly about everyone within my nuclear family, my wife and my two children, receiving a call from a friend. Your family had had an accident and all of that. Uh, why? How? Okay, and I understood, okay, was was prepared and all that. So I had already made up my mind I was going to drive. Uh, they would take public transport. We are driving down to the place and all that, the, to the village in Isoko. And then we'll drive back and all that. But along the line, that very, I was trying to, you know, going to work, going to work, trying to pull my car in order and all that. And then I did the weight balancing, the alignment and all that. And then, but I didn't touch, I didn't even check. I didn't, didn't know because before that time, it wasn't having issue with overeating and all that, nothing like that. So eventually we drove and a little, it would have been, it would have been just because, because I had a little delay that they were traveling. So my wife had even entered the road and she was already even going. I had to remind her, have you forgotten what I shared with you? This thing, this thing, this thing. God intervened in that uh, situation. She didn't go on tricycle and all that because uh, that revelation was very clear and very real that this was what they forget and all of that. And this was what happened. So eventually God intervened. I was able to carry my family myself. And then we got to almost the place, very close to the place. I saw that uh, the car was having issue of overheating. Although I later discovered one of the fans was not working. To cut a long story short, I discovered even the gasket got burnt. But that's not where I'm going. We, we got to the place. I managed to start. We got to where we're going and all of that. Used the car and all that. Then in the middle of the night again, there was a battle with a black cat. And I, the, the black cat was dealt with. I shared with them why we were there. And I look at what I saw and they look at what eventually happened and all that. So I had always known that the battle could be there, but as long as God is revealing and then you know how to navigate the fight, you know how to you know how to direct your fight and all of that. But would you know that I was coming back yesterday because I couldn't get where to buy a gasket uh the weekend on Sunday. So we have to just call. It was somebody who bought a cap from Worry a Mechanic. Who not to my car because I needed to go to work this morning. So and I wanted to leave that village on that Sunday since Friday I've been there. So that's how we came. In fact, our coming down to worry yesterday was just God's mercy because the thing would just be cutting different thing. My wife was a little bit apprehensive, the in-law was apprehensive and all that. But in all, we saw the hand of God. Would you know that somebody came for that barrier? He was drunk for that barrier. Very, I was told he was so drunk, he came there, he, got, he still got drunk again, and he carried the keke, the tricycle. By the time he got to the day, he hit the pavement by himself. Maybe he was trying to navigate something. They caught a long story short, that man died. That man died. So I was not wondering, oh, these were some of the things I was describing, I was, I was saying, and all that. That man died, as in somebody who came, he died. No, there are many, many issues in this life that people don't understand. Many, many. That's why people approach things. Either you are going for burial, you are going for wedding, you are going for... There are people who are not happy at all. They are just sadists in life. Wicked men and women. And that's the more reason. This morning now, we are going to be praying. We are going to be asking God, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, that the God of heaven will show us mercy, that the enemy of our lives and family will not overtake us without being aware. God in heaven will not allow them to overtake us. They will not overtake us. Before they plan, God has revealed. Before they plan, God has revealed. Before they plan, God has revealed. My God, help me. That my, you know, we have prayed this prayer before. 
that our spiritual Father, antenna, worship and bless our spiritual antenna will be sensitive. Our spiritual antenna will be real. That God will help us. We will not enter into trouble. Yes, we will not enter into trouble. Thank you for your being there. We thank you for being our guidance. Thank you for being our protector. We thank you because it was some battles that we do not even know about. You are fighting them. You are keeping us safe. We worship you. Father God, you always bless you. children and the ill law we reference you lord we give you glory lord we give you honor lord we thank you for everything amen amen we want to pray now we want to pray now we're going to uh soak and dip our family our wives and children inside the pool of the blood if you are not having children yet you will have of course your own children and then you can now begin to pray for them. If you are not married yet, then you can also commit them to God. The the woman you want to marry, of course, you will marry. If they are singles, who are listening to me, we want to pray that the God of heaven will shield our ch- As the year is running to our end, we will not be running out of uh, going to the hospital, and then receiving calls that this has happened to, my, to your wife, to my wife. No, God forbid. No negative thing, no evil thing shall befall them. If we are not with them, they will be secure. If they are far away from all, they will be secure. Wherever they are, the presence of God, the power of God, the hand of God shall rest upon them. Please, let's take all of this prayer to God in Father, prayer. Father, we lift up our family to your hands. We thank you for how you have always been with us. We thank you for your hand that is mighty upon us. Oh Lord, we worship and bless your name for everything. I thank you for how you kept my wife, even though I was far away in Londo, and she was the burden, and though she was admitted, but yet she came back in and healthy. We worship and bless your name for everything. We we'll give you glory, we we'll give you honor. We we'll thank you for your protecting power. We we'll thank you, Lord, for your protecting power. We we'll thank you for your hand upon our children. I thank you for my daughter in Imo. I thank you for my daughter in in Lekki, I thank you for my son, my son's in the battle, and then for the little one with us at home. We exalt your name for your presence all over us. We worship and bless your name, O oh Lord. We worship and reference. We give you glory, Lord, for all that you are doing. We pray. We exalt you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Yeah, it's running to an end. Let's begin to remind the Lord of the goodies, of the things we told him during covenant months. Can you remember what you can you remember what you told him? Can you remember your desire? Can you remember the things? The things you are expecting God this year for your family. And they are yet to be accomplished. They are yet to be fulfilled. Can we begin to tell the Lord and remind him? The scripture say the word that has spoken second Samuel seven verse twenty five concerning thy servant and concerning this hour, establish it forever and do as thou hast said. Let God do as he has promised. Let God do as he has declared. He said he will hasten his word to perform it in Jeremiah chapter 1, verse 12. Let God hasten his word, hasten his promises. Please remind God of the things he told you. Remind God of the promises you have claimed. Remind God of the promises of all that you have done for us from the beginning of the year till now. Father, you have been so faithful. Oh Lord, you have been so good. Father, you have been doing so many things. Us and do great things that we ever expect, oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Oh Lord, God, that we have been so good, that we have been so kind, that we have been providing 
So when you have led to a point, you can hand over to Pastor Matthew. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Welcome, sir. Okay, like our brother uh, shared, shared this experience during the barrier. Myself, too, I was in the barrier. And just to tell you that uh, a lot of things do happen. Though the barrier went forward, very, very successful, very no issues. But my friend, my very close friend, went to a barrier. The same area I went to barrier in the land of Ilaje. He went to bury his grandfather. Yesterday, I called him. I was, in fact, he called me. He was sharing with me <coughs> his experience. You know, at the barrier, they would say, a lot of family, family, family members member stay at the reception point. Only the family, family members. members. The ministers, the barrier site. So as they went, leaving their people at the reception, not up to 10 minutes there, according to him, he said as soon as they wanted to start the burying, every rain started to the point that his own younger one, because they've not been to that village before, it's their mother's village, they've not been there before. Their younger ones, the sisters, they all ran into the car, but he stood with his mother, because the senior is the firstborn, he stood with the mother in the rain. Say before you know, the rain was so much that even the grave was covered with water. So they had to start packing water, any water, 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 so they now called him and told him that the no run did not run. If they have run away from the rain, the rain will never have stopped. And your grandfather would have not been buried. So you see, Africa is just a very funny place that, uh, especially when we are going for barriers, we need a lot of prayers. So we are going to lift up our voice and bless the name of the Lord once again for our pastor and his family that they went safely and came back safely. You see, actually, we don't know the battles that God is fighting for us. For us, 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 Okay, sir. So when it comes to especially barriers, a lot of things do happen. So we are going to lift up our voice and bless the name of the Lord again for a protecting power over his own. Let's worship and bless the name of the Lord. Let's reference him. Let's thank him for the great and marvelous things he has been doing. Let's thank him for taking our pastor and his family to that uh, it's so cool land. You may say it's not far. Uh, Okay, the man that died also came from maybe from somewhere very close because coming with a tricycle that means it's closer than even maybe maybe not even come from worry, but he died. But God kept our brother and his wife and his children. Let's worship and bless the name of the Lord for that. Thank you because of you have promised us in your word that you shield us from every angle. Father, you are showing it to our brother, you are showing it to our sister, you are showing it to the children. We worship and bless your name. We worship and refresh your name. We give you glory because you are God. We give you all of because you are God. Thank you for ever being there for us. We worship and bless your name, O oh Lord. We worship and refresh your name, O oh Lord. The glory, honor, and worship are thanks be to your name, O oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Thank you for everything that you have done. 
We pray, O oh Lord, that all that they are that they do at this time, O oh Lord, you will replenish them. And open windows of heaven, you will provide for them. You will feed them back. In the name of Jesus, O oh Lord, worship and adore your name for everything you have done. Glory to God. Oh no, Lord. Give me adoration, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Now we are going to pray. The year is running to an end. Like me, for me now, this uh, weekend I was in uh, Ondo. I came back on Saturday. And uh, yesterday being Sunday, in fact, I could not even go to church. I have to listen to message online because I have to uh, travel again to your state. In fact, I'm in Ibadan right now. I left Lagos after five yesterday evening, driving down to Ibadan. I'm in Ibadan now to pick up my wife. My wife came to attend the sister's uh, birthday while I traveled to Undo and got getting here, she got sick. And the first was admitted and discharged on Saturday. But she said that she would please come and pick her up to bring her home because she might not have the strength to enter a public transport. That's why I have to come down, though very tired, but I have no choice. I just have to come down. And this is another week again. Now, this week, I'm traveling again to my village for a barrier. Now, I, I want the brethren to also pray for me and for all those that will be traveling this week. Because a lot of yes, 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 Shall we pray? Dear Father, we want to thank and bless your name for oh God, all those that will be traveling. We want to specifically pray for our pastor who will be traveling this week for the burial who God in his village. I pray that your presence will go with him. And I pray for as many who will be traveling, oh God, this week. Let your presence go with them in the name of Jesus. Father, we cover the world with the blood of Jesus. We know a lot of evil, a lot of atrocities have been committed on the road. Father, we pray that you will cancel every form of atrocity on the ways of your people in the name of Jesus. Holy Father, righteous God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The GCK has moved to India. In fact, when I heard it at first, I was like, wow, India. And uh, some people, the way they were able talking, were feeling it may not happen, they may change it. But now you, you are seeing pastor even on the street of India, doing the publicity, inviting people personally to the program. Now we are going to pray that as this GCK starts, we know the story and the history of India. Uh, most of them are not Christians. They have a lot of uh, idol worshippers. A lot of them are different characters, worshipping cows, worshipping different funny things. But the gospel has moved there. Now we are going to pray that as GCK has moved to India, that God will use the GCK to break a lot of beliefs in India. That God will arrest the great and mighty people in India. Those they are great men that they look up to as their chief priests, that God will arrest them. As God arrested Saul in his time, that he appeared to him, called him Saul, Saul. What persecuted thou me? That God will appear to all those they are idol worshippers, those they are chief priests, those they are mighty men that they look up to. That the gospel will break through them, that God we sweep the land of India and bring them to their need for Christ. Shall we pray? Almighty Father, we want to thank you. Thank you, Father, because of the power of the gospel. The Bible says that the word of God, the power gospel is powerful. Thank you, Father, because the gospel has moved to India. Who oh God, we pray that, Lord, you will support our pastor. Your power will come down mightily upon him. I pray that, Father, there will be great manifestation of your power in India to see, oh God, the source of men. 
Oh Lord, Father, we pray, deliver the restriction. We pray that Lord, you will break every form of restriction. You will destroy every form of restriction. And you will bring, oh God, Father, Indians under the knees of Christ in Jesus' name. Almighty Father, we are praying and we are asking, oh God, that your power, oh God, will be manifested. That India, oh God, will remember, oh God, the visitation of the man of God for all the rest of their life. Who go visit India? 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 Save the people who put their eyes, oh God, to see the truth, to know the truth, to walk in the truth. Lord Jesus, you are the King, you are the Messiah. I pray, reveal yourself to them, reveal yourself to them. All the idol worship, oh Lord, I pray, they will neglect, they will forsake, and they will come to Christ in the name of Jesus. The Bible says, Come unto me, all you that live on every day. Oh God, I pray, all Indians, oh God, will come to you. The women, we come to you. The children, we come to you. The men, we come to you. Oh, oh mighty Father, we pray that you will save them to the uttermost. Who oh, God save Indian to the uttermost. Who oh, God save them to the uttermost. Who oh, God save them to the villages. Who oh, God save them to the cities. Who oh, God save the Elites. Who oh, God save the Elites. Save them, Lord. Amen. Now we see in the book of the Act of the Apostle when the revival started that uh, the Bible says 5,000 men gave their life to Christ. We are going to pray that in this GCK in India, that God, like that first time when the revival started in the Act, in the Act of the Apostle, that God will also bring that kind of revival to India, that more than 5,000 men will surrender their lives to Christ. Because remember also that the Bible says, Jesus said, if I will be lifted up, like that serpent was lifted up, that if I will be lifted up, I will draw all men to myself. That is the word of God. You are going to pray and say, God, as your servant has gone to India, Yes. And we know that it's not the name of 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 Christ. That as he has taken the name of Christ to Indian, that God will fulfill that word, that all men that looked up to Christ at this crusade, they will be saved. Shall we pray? <laughs> We come before you, oh Lord. Father, we pray in the name of Jesus. All in there, we know the Lord. Lord, Lord. So to be added to the kingdom. So to be added to the kingdom. We be added to the kingdom. And we pray in the name of Jesus. As we to the kingdom, as we to the God, I pray. Father, add more to the kingdom. Add more to the to the kingdom. Men and women, not a few. Add them to the kingdom. Add them to the kingdom. Add them to the kingdom. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. The Bible says, God has spoken once, twice have I heard it, that power belongs unto God. And the same Bible says, when they see signs and wonders, they will believe. Let us pray that at this great GCK in India, that God... <laughs> We honor his words that God will do great and mighty miracles in the midst of the people, that the name will walk. The 
with their strength. Even the dead, God, 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 Almighty Father, we come before you in the name of the Lord Jesus. Father, there is nothing you cannot do. God, there is nothing you cannot do. Father, we pray in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Lord, by the strength of the Lord. Let there be a mighty miracle. Oh, let there be a mighty miracle. Our God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power, who went about doing evil and healing all that were oppressed. For God was with him. Who oh, God be with our pastor. Be with our pastor, who God for signs and wonders. Be with our pastor, who God for mighty miracles. Be with our pastor, who God for mighty manifestation. Be with our pastor, who God for your for mighty move of your power. Who God power to heal. Who power to save. Who God power to deliver. Who God power to cast out demons. Who God power to go to heal. Power to go to do miracles. Power to do signs and wonders. Who God I pray. As we are in the book of Acts, when the people surrendered, sur surrendered, who got their works? As we are in the who God I pray? For their idols, who God will be submitted? They will submit their idolatry. They will submit their idols. Will submit their idols. In the name of Jesus, who God I pray? By your power, by your mind, Indians will submit. Indians will submit. They will submit with the power of Christ. Amen. 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 There was one Amen. Amen. program. Amen. 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 Somebody was late. Was just sitting. And an usher. Just edged and he didn't know he was lame. He just said, My brother, stand up and join the brethren. And the man just stood up and started running walking, join the brethren to jubilate and things like that. Let's pray that all these kind of miracles we have seen in Lagos, 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 all the miracles we have seen, like we know in Taraba, the first time Pastor went to Taraba, a lot of lame people who were using this, their small, small trolley to sit and beg, a lot of them received strength, they stood up. We saw great miracles in Taraba that year. And in other places, we are seeing wonderful things. We are seeing even uh, this uh, cancer vanished. We are seeing a lot of things in Nigeria, in Africa. Let's pray that more than what we have seen in Africa, we see in India, that God will move in a mighty way. He will move around the land of India, that even when this is being telecast in other places, you know, there are times they are like eight hours be, uh, behind Nigeria. And maybe it's after it has happened there, they will not broadcast here because we cannot join. It's not possible. We cannot join in their own time. So that when we are also, when it's being televised in other places in the world, that God will move mightily around the world at this November program the greater miracle that we have seen, we will see in this program in India. Shall we pray? Father, Father we come before you, O God. Father, we pray. The Bible says in the days of God's power, the people will be willing. Father, we pray, Lord, let there be mighty Anything manifestation of your power in the name of Jesus. Oh, come on, oh, miracle. Oh, come on, 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 let there be a common miracle. Mighty miracle. Miracle at a fool. Miracle at a fool. Where the lame will always rise. Where the dead will be raised back to life. Oh, come on, miracle. 
Amen. We are going to pray for our Father and the Lord, Pastor W.F. Kumuye, who is the alcohol of this program. That God, that God we, we lay, lay, lay my mind upon him. You know, it's 82 years, years now. now. It's, it's not, not younger. We give him his wisdom to give to Moses. That he will be successfully under the ministry for another 40 years. That God will. Give our pastor that special grace that he will still carry on, on if Jesus tarries for more than another 40 years. That God will keep him moving. The hand of God will march upon him. That the, the anointing will be renewed every minute in the name of Jesus. Let's pray for our Father and the Lord. Father, we bring our pastor before you. We pray, oh God, Father, for more grace. Father, more grace, oh God, we pray. Give him more grace. Power, oh God, give him more power. Oh Lord, let your hand rest upon him. Let your power work in him mightily. Let your power work in him mightily. Let your power work in him mightily. Let your power walk in it mightily. Let your power walk in it mightily. In the name of Jesus. Who let your power? Who let your power? Who let your power? Who let your power? Let your power walk in it mightily. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name father will worship and bless your name for a time like this, we thank you for the privilege to come together and pray. You said in your word, if two of us, or three of us, you come together and pray that you are in the midst of us. Father, we thank you because we have God this morning. We thank you for the testimony we had. So thank you for how you also protected me throughout all the time. Traveling from here and there. You are still okay. You are going to worship you. You are going to bless you. I say glory, honor, and I shall thank you be unto your name, O Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Father, we thank you for the GCK that has moved to the land of India. O Lord, we know Indian for their Hindu and their idol worshiping. Father, but yet the Sabbath has decided to take Jesus to India. Father, we are praying, O oh Lord, as he has gone to India for this wonderful GCK, more than what you have seen, more than what you have heard, more than what you have uh, had in form of testimony before. Father, we pray, O oh Lord, you will do in the land of India, O oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Your words. That if I but be lifted up, I will draw all men to myself. Father, we pray, O oh Lord, we are bringing you to remembrance according to that your to that your word. At uh, this time in India, we are not lifting up the name of Pastor W. F. Kumuyi. We are not lifting up the name of the Father We are not lifting up the name of the Father 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 of the
negative to positive. That is the Christ we are preaching. Oh Lord, in heaven we pray that at this program, oh Lord, you will honor your word and save all men that lift up their eyes to look unto you at this program, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I commit your servant, Pastor W.F. Kumiye, to your hand. We saw him on the street publicizing. We saw him doing a lot of things. We are praying, oh Lord, that the virtue, the strength that has gone out, you will restore back unto him, oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Your servant Moses in his time is here for the wedding. Let's get us. Oh God, now we pray. That you carry on this ministry further and further if you tarry, oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, we worship and bless your name because we know you have had our prayers. We commit this new week, oh Lord, to your hands. All that we lay our hands upon, we pray that they will prosper, oh Lord. We continue to keep us day to day, time after time. As we travel up and down, oh Lord, your pleasure will continue to go with us. There will be no accident, there will be no any incident. That will make headline news, oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. To round up the year, Father, we pray, O Lord, that I provide for us, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Bible says, 40 years before this time, God had told the children of Israel, I will take you to me for a people. And I will be to you a God, and you shall know that I am the Lord, your God, which bringeth you out from under the burden of the Egyptian. Uh, when you look at this country, we are talking about the, I call them the great India. You will see that they are, they are the one that civilized the United States. You will see that they are one among the uh, world. world power when you trace a lot of things a lot of things to them you will see how mighty they are religiously you will see that they are very powerful they are the one one can say that paul was saying uh actually you love god but the kind of the god you love yes uh one of our pastor wrote something out that we should be mindful of the language we are using so i uh, won't go further on that so we will call upon the name of the Lord. It is the promise of the Lord that he doesn't want anybody to perish. And by the grace of the Lord, he has extended that salvation to them. We will call upon the name of the Lord. The effort of our pastor, at Pastor W.F. Kumuyi, will not be in vain in Jesus' name. Let's Amen. hope we are not there, call upon the name of the Lord. Mighty Father, we pray in the name of the Lord. Lord. Yes, of the Lord. 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 As God of is the name of the Lord. 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 the gospel of Christ to the people of India. We do not in vain in the name of Jesus. We do not in vain in the name of Jesus. Lord, I pray in the name of the Lord. Lord, I pray in the name of the Lord. Lord, I pray in the name of the Lord. Lord, I pray in the name of the Lord. Lord, I pray in the name of the Lord. Now, this time to India, I oh God, I pray that the power will not be wasted. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. Oh God, I pray, do my thing, oh God. Let it be memorable. Let it be, oh God, go into remembrance. As the past year, the gospel will be going to India. Let it be on record, oh God. 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 Let it be on record, to remember, miracles that they will continue to remember, miracles that they will continue to remember. Who God does pray by your power, by your might, O God. The way we have not been expected, that by the power that the Lord is not going to be able to do it, it is India in the name of Jesus, and the name of the Lord is glorified, and the name of the Lord is glorified, and the name of the Lord is glorified. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. In one minute that remains, we now use it to pray ourselves for ourselves. God remember India. 
God keep it, keep using our GS so the be a way. See how little do you see what, what I saw in GS? Very humble. Very, very humble. Look at he, when he took the, 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 the retreat and the crusade to Ibadan. You know, Ibadan is a center of the uh, the capital city of Oyo State. Then I don't know. Something I don't know what really caused it. My my thought was that it's going to be going to every state, then to other country. Then the pastor took it back to Ogoma show. When you consider Ogoma show, is is the uh, <laughs> now I don't know because uh, uh, when you are comparing Ogoma show to all other, I'm talking about humility. But I had reports that what happened in Ogoma show in all other crusades. It has never happened there from the report I had in terms of population, in, in, in time of confession, in time of one king was even preached boldly before be, before people. Now look from that Ogoma show on now to the great India, the most populous, if I'm not mistaken, between it and the, uh, China. I think China is the most populous. But among the powerful, among the powerful nations. He will not call upon the name of the Lord on, on that on that resort to ourselves. That Father, you that you do not forget in there. You that you prom- you keep promoting our GS in humility. Father, it is my tongue. But the power in the blood of Jesus Christ financially, spiritually, spiritually of time. For your glory in Jesus' name. Open your mouth, call upon the name of the Lord. Call upon the name of the Lord. That oh my Father, I surrender my life to you. Yes, Jesus is in the end. As my name is the Lord. Some of you are here. 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 Some
Ye worship ye know not what. We knew what we worship for salvation is of the Jews. Father in heaven, we know the history of Indians, that they have been great worshippers. Like that woman says, our fathers worship in this mountain. But you are saying Jerusalem is the right place to worship. Oh Lord, oh, Lord, Lord. Lord we pray that, 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 that we open the eyes of men and women in India to see that we worship that they have been hold on to all their lives. Man, man, be, 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 Connecting to that great anointing, Amen. In your servant, Amen. we pray, O oh Lord, that we too be useful in your kingdom. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Amen. We have to shine forth the light. Father,